happy Monday and welcome back to my channel. Okay, normally on Mondays, what you would typically see on my channel would be what I wore, what I kept, what I got rid of. Yeah, so that's that's changing a little bit. I, I, I haven't quite decided exactly how I'm gonna do the what I wore segment. We talked about that last week, but I will definitely continue to bring you the what I kept from my boxes for that week and what I let go of out of my closet in order to keep those things. The reason I didn't bring you one today is because last week I only did one box, one box, and that was my Transcend box. So instead of just doing a whole segment over one box, I thought I'll just add that to this week because when I came home from being out of town Saturday, I had three boxes sitting in my house. So this week will be full, very, very full. So let's start with this big, huge trunk. Trunk Club. Trunk Club comes out of Nordstrom. Uh, it's a $20 styling fee. Um, if you have a Nordstrom card, that styling fee is waived. But if you don't, whatever you keep, that $20 will go towards it. Um, if pieces are on sale, you get the sale price. You do not work one-on-one -on -one with a stylist. You work with a styling team. But as long as you are willing to really communicate with them and be patient, <laughs> you can get some things that you really love. Um, I've learned that I just have to be a little bit more specific about what I want. And when I look at a trunk, if there's things, because they send you a preview, if there's things that I know I'm not gonna keep, then send it back, send me something else, okay? Now, once they do that, you don't have any choice. Once they like remove items from your trunk and put new ones in, then that's what you're gonna get. But it does give you that first opportunity to change things. Now, I will tell you on this, I was super busy. <laughs> this, I was super busy when this preview got sent and I saw they said, review your trunk and I looked at it real quick and I'm like, it's fine, just send it. And so I do know what's in here because I've already unpackaged it because the way it comes, it's all wrapped in plastic. And so I already took everything out of the plastic. And so I do know exactly what's in here. Um, but I just, I just didn't have time to really think and swap and all that, but there's some really awesome things in here. All right, let me get everything out of the trunk, do my little bundle for you, and then we'll get started. Okay, I've got everything out. Uh, they send you a little envelope like this. It comes inside your trunk, and what's inside is a lot of stuff. Your return label. Okay, so the way this works is whatever you decide you're not gonna keep, you put right back in the trunk, okay? Right back in the box that came in. They send you these little tape strips that you can tape the box back up, and then, then you just put the return label right on the box, and then I schedule a pickup. You can take it to a FedEx um, location and, and ship it, but I just schedule right on their app and so they come and get it. Here is my invoice. This will tell me how much everything is, the brand names and all that kind of things. You do get a referral link. Anytime you have a Trunk Club account, you get a referral code. That referral code is worth $50. So if somebody uses your code, they get $50 off their trunk, you get $50 off y'all's. And so y'all have definitely, a lot of my viewers have done that with mine and I appreciate it so, so much. Okay, so let's get in here and see what I got. I got quite a few clothing items, but I also got a pair of shoes, which y'all know I love. Got a pair of earrings. These are by Madewell. I have gotten Madewell earrings in my last two trunks. So I think they figured out, oh, she likes Madewell jewelry. And then I got this cute little purse, y'all. This is really cute. I have two brown crossbody purses already. Um, they're a much lighter brown. This is more of a chocolate brown. What I have is kind of a camel brown, you know, more tan. So this might be, I don't know. I, I love crossbody purses. Oh, this one's very nice, y'all. Very, very nice. It has two zipper pockets. Plus this opening here. So it's really got three compartments. Um, not to mention the zipper right here, and so you could put things right there. So it's very, very soft. Sorry, the plastic's making a lot of noise. Let's look over the tag. Um, all right, hold on. <laughs> She's like, Mom, you are really making a lot of noise and disturbing me. Okay, so the bag. 
All right, it is um, a faux leather crossbody bag by Street Level in brown for $45. So that's actually a great price on that purse. All right, next is the jewelry. These are tiny little brushed gold hoops, tiny little huggies, which if y'all know me at all, you know that's kind of my thing. Now I am wearing these that I just got in Rock's Box a couple weeks ago. Y'all, I haven't checked out yet because I don't know why, but I'm hesitating on if I should keep them or not. What I'm gonna keep out of that box. All right, but back to this. All right, so these are adorable, adorable. Okay, let me see how much they are. And they are the Skinny Huggy Hoop Earrings by Madewell. They're saying they're the color gray. That is so funny. It's like a brushed gold for $20. Y'all, these are only $20. Yeah, those are cute. Super, super cute. I'll try those on in the try-on and see if y'all can see them. All right, then my shoes are by Caslon. Let's see what I got. Oh, yeah, I remember these from the preview. Okay, they are... A, let me take the pen. All right, they're slip-on, and this is like a canvas, frayed canvas. These are really cute, y'all. Super cute. Um, I've got quite a few pair of sandals that I love, so I doubt that I need those, but I'll try them on. I may just absolutely love, love them and not want to part with them. So let me see how much they are. They're called the Paxton Slide Sandal in Beige for $59.95. Okay, that, that's a good price for shoes. All right, here is my bundle. There is my bundle. All right. First piece is a kimono wrap. It's solid black, and I think it's cotton, y'all, the way it feels. And I can't really tell how it lays until I put it on. Because it's got a seam right here. It's kind of different, I think. I, I can't, it's, it's like a ruffle on the side. Can y'all even see that? So I'm not really sure how I feel about that, but I'll definitely try this on. You know, I mean, I try everything on, so, you know. But I guess what I'm saying is I will hold judgment until I try it on. <laughs> okay. All right, this is called the Solid Ruffle uh, Ruana in Black by Nordstrom for $49. And I, y'all know how much I love kimonos, and I don't, I don't have a solid black one, but I don't know. It's very, very wrinkled, and um, I'm not sure how I feel about that ruffle. This, y'all, I love this color. First of all, this color is so. Hang on, let me get these tags. This color is so, so pretty, y'all, and it has those big buttons. This is a cardigan. I like the weight of it. Uh, very, very pretty. It is by the brand Halogen. A relaxed fit cardigan in pink by Halogen for $69. I have this really cute um, top that's this color and it has a tie. <laughs> I think it would be really cute with this. I, I don't know. We'll try it. I may dress this up, like put on some black dress pants or something like I was going to wear it to church and try that on make an outfit out of it. That's really cute. Um, we got us some camo, you know, and I have a camo t-shirt, but I got it from Old Navy and I've worn it and worn it and watched it and worn it and it's pretty much done. So I would be happy to trade this one for that one. Uh, this is by Sanctuary. I love Sanctuary. Nice fabric. It's just a camo t-shirt. That is, uh, camo is a neutral in Texas. <laughs> it's a neutral, I think, in a lot of places. Uh, it's really cute. All right, this one's called the Perfect Print T-Shirt in Green by Sanctuary for $35.20. So that's not a bad price for a Sanctuary T-Shirt. I like that, it'll, it'll depend on the fit. All right, this one is by One State. Uh, it is a ribbed white T-Shirt. It's ribbed and then it has puffy white sleeves with this little twist detail I just now noticed. So, I mean, this is this could be cute. It's gonna depend on how it fits, if it's real fitted, and it's gonna depend on how puffy that is. And of course, the price, how much is this? It is $39.20, not bad. I just don't know, I just don't know. I'm always hesitant with white, solid, stark white. 
All right, this is so soft. When I was getting it out, I thought, oh, wow, that's soft. This is just a little t-shirt dress by Caslon. It's just a little olive green. Uh, it's got pockets. Just kind of, it's that boingy. The material always says it's kind of boingy. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Um, anyway, it's super soft. It's by Caslon. It's called the Sleeveless Swing Dress in Green for $35. So that's cute. That could be really good in the summer just to throw on and go. All right, this is really neat. I wasn't sure. Let's see, what are they calling this? They call it a one pocket button up shirt. But y'all, I kind of looked at it when I was taking it out and thought it was kind of like a very lightweight spring jacket. You know how in the fall we had all the jackets? That's kind of how I feel about this. It is a shirt, but it's very boxy, like a jacket. I love the print. I love the fabric. I don't know, what is this fabric? Let me see. It's polyester rayon spandex. It's by Treasure and Bond. I really love it. I think it's so cute. It does have a pocket. It's $55. Yeah, that's that's really cute. I like that a lot. And then Wit and Wisdom jeans. I can, oh, I love Wit and Wisdom jeans. I can almost tell you I'm gonna keep these because there's no distressing. Um, I like the little unfinished hem. I do not have any Wit and Wisdom like this at all. And Wit and Wisdom is one of my very favorite, um, very favorite brand of jean. They fit really, really well. And I'm kind of redoing my jeans. I'm always redoing my jeans. Y'all, I have a ton of jeans. But now that I'm doing what I'm doing, where, you know, if I keep something, I remove something, I don't mind. Because before, you know, I'd be like, oh, I've got so many jeans. I don't really need another pair of jeans. Well, now if I fall in love with a pair of jeans, I'm like, well, that's okay. I'll just trade them for another pair. So it's kind of freeing in that way. You know, it doesn't make me feel like, oh, I have too many jeans, I can't keep any more jeans. <laughs> if I fall in love with a pair of jeans, and I'm like, I think these will fill, you know, a space in my closet that is not being filled. Like I've got some of my very favorite jeans to wear are Wit and Wisdom, um, but they're all light wash. Every one of them are light wash. So this is dark wash, no distressing. Okay, what, this is, this is a pretty good trunk, y'all. This is a pretty good trunk. I'm excited. All right, let me go get this try-on started, and hopefully I'll find some pieces that I can't live without. Okay, here is this. I've got on three pieces. I've got on the Wit and Wisdom jeans. They're a winner. Um, the little sanctuary camo top, I love it. And here's this kimono. And I, I, this is what I was thinking. It's just too much fabric. It's a, there's a seam down here that makes the ruffle. Can y'all see it? I don't know if y'all can see it. It's black, it's hard to see. So it's just very overpowering. It's too much. I, I don't like it at, at all. So it almost feels, um, you know, like a costume, almost like a costume. You know what I mean? Like a, <laughs> like I'm in a play, a wizard or something. You know, you know what I'm saying? It just has that feel about it. Okay, so, <clears throat> all right, here's the Wit and Wisdom jeans. Love, love, love keeping. Definitely keeping. And then the sanctuary top, it could be a keep too. I really like it. I like the way it fits. Um, I'm My other camo top, like I said, it's really faded out. So I like this. I like this a lot. Okay. What else? Oh. Okay, now I'm going to keep the jeans on and try on some of the other tops. All right, here's the little white top by One State. I had to put a tank under it because it is very, very see-through. Uh, <laughs> hello, sweetie. <laughs> okay, she wants me to pick her up. Uh, but I'm just not about these sleeves, y'all. I just don't like the big puffy sleeves on me. I, I don't know, it just, it feels too young. These big puffy sleeves, they're so cute, but it just feels really too youthful on me. It's just kind of, I just, mm. Just not liking them. But this is a very cute top, y'all. And I thought it was a reasonable price, too. Let me remember the price. Because uh, One State is a very nice brand. And the shirt feels really good. I just, I just, I don't know. I just don't, I just don't like the puff sleeves. Yeah, it's $39. So it, it's a good price for that brand for sure. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go put on that little, what I think is more like a shacket. I'm gonna style it both ways. I'm gonna just button it up and then I'm gonna leave it open like a jacket.
Okay, I just put it on with a little um, black tank. And y'all, I think it's really cute, just kind of opened up like this. Could wear a white t-shirt under it. I could really, it's pretty neutral. I could wear probably any color under it. And it's very lightweight, but I think it's cut kind of like a jacket, you know what I mean? But because it's so lightweight, I think it's a perfect spring jacket. I'm kind of really liking this. All right, let me try it just as a shirt. Hold on. Y'all, I like this a lot. Um, these two pieces are definite, yes. I'm definitely keeping this. So here, here's something. Scott told me, because these boxes were here when we got home Saturday. And he told me, pick one of the boxes, get whatever you want, happy Mother's Day. He's pretty awesome. So yeah, I think I'm gonna use my trunk club. And um, yeah, I like this a lot. I like this a whole lot, y'all. This is super cute. I, I don't know, this is me. This is this feels like me. I've got a lot of different looks that I love. You know, I love the boho hippie chick vibe a lot. Then I like a, a more like the cardigan, my little Peter Pan, you know, deal, but I love plaid and gingham. So there's a lot of different things I love. I don't have just one look. Oh, let me try the earrings on. Let me try the earrings on, hold on. And the shoes. Okay, y'all, here's the earrings. Can y'all see them? They're really tiny, but if you know me at all, you know I kind of like that tiny look. So, you know, these would be just so easy. They're just kind of like that everyday pair of earrings that you just put on, you don't even feel them. All right, now I've got the shoes on. Uh, the shoes don't fit right. They're a little too big, and so my feet are sliding in them, but they're so cute, y'all. But here, let me show you. They're really, really cute. Here, I'm gonna uh, scroll the camera down so that uh, you can get a better look at them. Can you see them? But my foot is just sliding in them. So it's like when I walk, it feels like it's, you know, but they, they are cute, but I, I've got so many pair of sandals, I think I'm good. All right, so now let me go do the dress and the sweater. Not together, that would not look right, but I'll be right back. Okay, here is this dress. I think it was by Caslon. It's very comfortable, y'all. It's just, you know, your typical sleeveless t-shirt dress. It has pockets. Um, the fabric's very, very nice. The armholes are way too big. Um, and it's just a little t-shirt dress. I mean, I would have to wear something over it if I wore it to church. Even if I wore it like out shopping or something, I'd always have to wear something over it. Um, you know, because it just gets so cold in the stores and stuff. But um, and that's okay, because I got a lot of sleeveless stuff. I like sleeveless stuff, but this is just, just really plain, and I don't think I need it, but it's cute, y'all. It's really cute. Okay, last thing is that hot pink sweater. I'm excited to try to style that. Okay, this is the top that came to my mind when I saw this little pink sweater. Um, I love this little top. It's got a little tie. I've, I've not worn this skirt yet. I just recently bought this skirt. It's just a straight black uh, pencil skirt. So I just kind of put this all together because there's black in this top. I think this is cute. I can't tell if the pinks work together. Is it too much pink? You know, I love the sweater. I love the way it feels. It's a little oversized, but it's still fitted like a cardigan. So I kind of like it's a little bit of a relaxed fit, um, but I love it. I like the fabric. I'm not sure what the fabric is, but it's very, very soft. Um, but it's a lot of pink on pink. So I'm not sure if that's working. I think I'm gonna go try it on real quick with a different top and see what y'all think. I love this sweater, y'all. <laughs> love this sweater. Yeah, I just put my the Wit & Wisdom jeans back on and just grabbed a little top that I knew I had that had this pink in it. 
looks really cute. I love the way it fits. I think this is definitely a keeper, but I found there was, I immediately when I went to my closet to grab this, I thought of two things in my closet that I know this will go so well with. And there are two things that I typically will put a sweater over or a jacket over, but I always do denim or black. And this will be so much cuter. Well, let me show you. So here's one of my very favorite dresses in my closet. I love this little patchwork dress. But y'all look, <laughs> Even it, the, these are the buttons. That's the color of the buttons. Y'all, it's like it was made for it. It's like it was made for it. Yeah, that's stinking adorable. I think I know what I might be wearing to church this Sunday. And this little romper that I got, um, I don't know, a couple years ago from Versona. Look how cute that is. Look how well that matches, yeah. This is a keeper. I realized I hadn't showed you the purse. Okay, so I, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna keep it, so I'm not gonna take the plastic off of the thing. Sorry for the noise, but, oh. Okay, so here it is. It, you know, it's great. It's actually really great. I like, I actually like it a whole lot. I'm a sucker for crossbody purses. I, I really do like it. This is really cute. But y'all, I have two brown leather crossbody purses. So I'm gonna have to resist the temptation to keep this. This was an excellent trunk, y'all. Excellent. So I know I wanna keep this. I know I wanna keep the Wit and Wisdom jeans. Uh, the other three things that I really think I wanna keep I really think I want to keep these earrings. They're just so cute and easy to wear. And the sanctuary top, I loved, but I could live without this. I could. I could save my husband some money and live without this. But this, I think I'm going to have to keep. <laughs> this I really, really, really loved. I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think. I don't know what your favorite pieces are, what you think I ought to keep. And then I will just say, happy Mother's Day to me. Thank you, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, I hope y'all are having a really, really wonderful Monday, and this week is going to be a little different, you know, because like I said, normally I would have done what I wore, what I kept, what all the things, but I didn't, so my videos are going to be strange this week. Not strange, but just a little out of order, but next Monday, I will definitely have a what I kept, what I sent back, and possibly a what I wore. I'm not really sure if I'm doing that yet or how I'm going to do it, so we'll see. That's, that's yet to be determined. All right, guys, y'all have a great day today. And until we get back together again, y'all stay safe, you stay well, and I'll see you next time.